Liquid Symmetries is a kind of Sinfonia Concertante of the 21st century and sociology was my main motivation. You know, I always need an intellectual motivation. However, music should not be just intellectual, but also communicative. I think that to enjoy simplicity, to really taste the essence of things, you must first be sophisticated. Although I don't like routines, it is almost always the same process. I write the first sketches of a new piece quite fast, and I found that if I don't spend too much time with details at the beginning, the music is more spontaneous, and after, it remains wet. Of course, after that you need to be careful when refining this, because otherwise you could kill the spontaneity and, and, and the fluency of the music. It is often very difficult to put in words something that was conceived with with colors, with shapes, with textures. I was very interested in the Polish thinker Sigmund Bauman's notion of the liquid society in which we live today. His ideas were very inspiring for me and I suppose that I was in some way translating his thoughts into music. For example, the structure of the pieces liquid in the sense that everything changes before it gets consolidated. It was not the first time I was writing music evoking social concerns. This is like my piano concertino No se de yo quien diga nada or my hyperludes for solo violin are also very connected with aspects of our civilization. For me it is very important to say something about our way of living. It is important to the point that sometimes, quite often actually, I utilize musical material that I am against, but of course intelligent listeners will realize that actually I introduce this material as a, let's say, protest. I, I don't like instability in my life, however for me it is very hard to avoid instability in my music, precisely because everything seems so unstable in, in our society. Mm -hmm.